Hi everyone, Richard here. Today we're bringing you an update to help with the uh, base building system. Uh, it's one of the things we got feedback from all of last week. Many people were not happy with it. Uh, we knew it needed work, but after we had so many players come onto the game, uh, we decided to push forward the update for this as soon as possible. Um, so uh, we've added a ton of stuff. We've put in a whole new snapping system in and uh, we've also added rotation because that was also uh, a really um, a really highlighted feature that people wanted to uh, play. Um, we went back and looked through the current system that we had and we realized how poor it was. Um, all the different combinations people were coming up with it wasn't having it so we've take, we've gone back to the draw board and we've gone back to a fully snapped system um, so you can see here like all the different combinations um, that will snap quickly and easily um, and you'll be able to see that you can really quickly and effectively build bases now um, if all of the annoying uh, parts in the old build system that we had at launch should hopefully be for the most part gone um, but again uh, we'll have to see uh, what feedback and what tests you guys uh, do and what kind of bases you build. Um, the stairs were one of the main issues and uh, hopefully we fix that. The stairs snap a lot better now. We've ended up changing the stairs to a two combination rather than a one um, due to rotation and snap points. It was just it just meant that it conformed way better to the new system that we've built this week. Um, and uh, yeah, generally that's about it. Um, you should find now that when you build a base, a lot of the annoying niggles are gone. Things should snap from a distance way better. Um, and as you'll see, I'll demonstrate by uh, building a, a rotated base um, and building a set of stairs up. One of the things that people were saying is that they had a problem getting to the monolith, for example. They can work out to build. This new system should make things like that way easier. And we would like to build on it in the future and make it better. Um, but as you'll see in the video, I'll uh, build up a quick set of stairs using pillars, um, just a, uh, four levels of stairs. Um, the stability system, we've, we've uh, improved the UI, so you should get feedback on exactly why things are unstable or, or, or stable. Um, so you'll know uh, if it's not placing Y, and it should tell you because stability, because not stability, etc. So as long as you keep your eye out and you have a look for what is uh, telling you, you should be able to understand why this, uh, why that uh, that particular piece isn't placing. Um, so yeah, hopefully this is way better for everyone, and we'll be pushing this update uh, today, and uh, we will put the old build on an old version. So if you want to go and finish your games on that version, by all means, go for that. Um, but we'll be phasing out the launch version soon so anyone that's still recording video on that um, you can switch back to that and keep playing but if you're playing in a currently in progress game with an old save um, the new build system will conflict with buildings you've already made so to be clear um, this system on the new version in an old save will probably not function correctly um, however you can go into your old save and build a new base um, and it should work again fine but if you don't want any of this to take effect then you're going to want to switch back to the old version and finish your game and then at your leisure come on to the new version um, when you want to um, come onto the new build system but apart from that uh, thanks very much and uh, I hope to see you soon bye